welcome to MSMS. Mississippi's only public residential high school for academically gifted seniors and seniors. We are the senior emissaries at MSMS and we are so excited to show you on your tour today. We are located in Columbus, Mississippi on the Mississippi University for Women's Campus. Hi guys, this is Mary Wilson. It houses our executive director's office. Come on, let's take a look. This is Mary Wilson, and this is where our packages go whenever they're too big to go into the Hogarth Post Office. Come on, let's go to Hooper. This is Hooper, our main academic building. It houses our English, math, science, and world language courses. Also, it requires an ID to get in, so don't forget it. So, let's go inside. Welcome to the English department. MSNS teachers qualify as adjunct professors for MUW, so we can earn university-level dual enrollment credit for some of our classes, like University of American Literature or University Composition. This is one of our world language classrooms. MSMS offers five world languages with only two world language teachers. We offer Spanish, French, Latin, German, and Russian. Upstairs Hooper is our science department. If you see here, most of the classrooms are set up like a lecture and lab. Our science department offers unique courses such as Intro to Epidemiology and Intro to Biochemistry. All of our teachers have office hours where you'll be able to come by and ask questions if you have them. Hey, Ms. Truitt. This is Shackleford, home of our social science, art, computer science, and engineering courses. Come on, let's take a look. This is the art studio. MSMS offers many visual arts, such as drawing, painting, sculpture, and photography. Welcome to our engineering lab. This is where we have our computer science and engineering classes, like intro to game design and 3D modeling. Last year, I took a class in here called Intro to Engineering, and we made so many cool projects like egg launchers and bridges. All around here, we have eight 3D printers for the students to use, which is pretty awesome. Um, this space is also home to some clubs, like the Vex Robotics Club, which I was a part of. We made this robot right here. We designed, built, and tested it all in here. We took it to a competition. It was really fun. So this is our Performing Arts Center, where all of our music classes are held, like guitar and piano, um, band, and choir. And even though we have all of these amazing classes, you don't have to be a to be a musician to do that because we have them on so many different levels that you can start as a complete beginner. Um, this is also the place where our Blue Notes choir and band um, practices in preparation for the annual Sights and Sounds tour where we either go to New Orleans or Memphis. This is our library that we share with MUW. Starting this year, the library will be requiring key card access at all times. Let's go inside and check it out. MEW has a 24 hour computer lab and several study rooms, which are a great place to get some extra studying done after school. The library is also a place that we can spend our mandatory study hours. All students are required study hours from Sunday through Thursday, 7 to 9 p.m., during which time we must be in an academic setting doing some studying. We can earn some of those nights back through good grades, behavior, and attendance. Also during study hours, we have tutorials during which some teachers will return to campus and offer students some help on either things they may have missed or some assignments they're struggling with at homework. These are our dorms. So going is our girls' dorm, and just around the corner is Frazier, which is our boys' dorms. So now if we head over here, you're going to find these stairs, and it leads up to our front lobby. And in the front lobby, there's always someone manned at the desk to help you out with anything like sign-ins or if you have any problems that you need to resolve at the dorm. So if you want to enter the dorms, you need to use your MSMS key card or your ID. So you just scan and you enter. So let's go check it out. This is the computer lab, and this is where we can all of our homework and assignments. And if you don't have a laptop, don't worry. MSMS will provide you with a computer right here just for you. This is a sick room, so if a student catches anything contagious, then they can quarantine themselves in there until their parents come and pick them up. And on the other side, we have our model room. So our model room gives you a general idea of what our dorms look like, and it comes with a desk, a bed, and two dressers for you and your roommate. Also, all of um, our dorms are connected by a bathroom, so you have your room and your suitmate's room. So this is our lounge, and over here we have things like toasters and microwaves to heat up food, and we also have lots of seating arrangements here, 
and throughout like couches so that you can have study groups with your friends or you can just hang out with them in the lounge. Um, we also have RAs who are so nice and are always here for us and they live on each wing of our dorms on every single floor so they work for us 24-7. This is our laundry room. These are our washers and these are our dryers and each wash and dry is a dollar. And you can either pay through coin or you can also pay through an app called Speed Queen. And what's really, really great about Speed Queen is that it also tells you when your clothes are done. MSMS also has access to the MUW Police Department, which helps keep this campus safe. After it gets dark, the side gates are closed, and anyone who wishes to enter must enter through the front gate, which always has a guard on duty. We also have access to MUW's Health Center, which has a nurse on duty every Monday through Friday from 8 to 5. So this is Start Recreational Facility. Let's go check it out. Here at Start, we can work out and exercise, play basketball, or play volleyball. It's a great place to earn our required bonus hours because at MSMS, we have to get 18 every nine weeks. So here at MSMS, we have five sports teams, cross country, track, soccer, tennis, and swim. And we also have multiple sports clubs like volleyball and basketball club, both of which practice on the court and start. This is the dining hall half of Hogarth. Let's go take a look inside. We share the dining hall with MBW. This side is specifically for MSMS students though. There are lots of great options for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, including special lines for vegetarians and those with special dietary restrictions. This is Hogarth. It is home to the Office of Student Affairs downstairs and the Office for Advancement and Admissions upstairs. It also has the post office. Each student shares a post office box with one other student. Thanks so much for joining us today. If you want to learn more, please check out our website, www.bmsms.org.